This order has taken on a life of its own, Your Honor, and it is my fault that I, I have not stood up sooner and explained to the court that I am an educated vaccine choice mother, and I have signed vaccine waivers and have been fully compliant with all state Michigan laws for both of my children for every school year. And if my child is going to be forced to be vaccinated, I couldn't bring myself to do it. It goes against my beliefs, Your Honor. My marriage to Mr. Horn was annulled over nine years ago. And we've always shared the same beliefs on vaccinations until recently. I beg the court to see that Mr. Horn's newfound belief on vaccinations is nothing more than his leverage for him and his attorney. November 30th, you appeared to set that order aside. You never went before me. You agreed in a consent order to vaccinate your child, one. Two, I understand you love your children. But what I don't think you understand is that your son has two parents and dad gets a say. And the record, I urge you to, to review it and anyone else, what you just said, that he has a newfound objection, is not true. You've repeatedly stated over the past several days publicly that you will not follow this court order. So I'm sentencing you to seven days in jail. And I also award dad temporary physical custody while you are incarcerated and until enough time has passed for him to bring your son's vaccinations up to date as rapidly as medically necessary, which is the language in the order.